Let's try this problem, okay? This is a freezing point depression problem. It says, what is the expected freezing point of a solution that contains 25.0 grams of fructose, um, C6H12O6, and 250.0 grams of water? And then it gives the Kf of water being 1.86 degrees Celsius per molar. So in order to do this problem, we have to remember, well, what is the um, uh, equation for molar? Okay, so molal, or molality, is the number of moles of solute divided by the mass in kilograms of um, solvent. Okay, so we need to figure out those things first. So, water is the solvent in this case. So, number of kilograms, 1,000 grams per kilogram. It's going to be 0 0.2500 kilograms. Is everybody okay with that one? Yes. Canceling that. Okay, so this is the mass of fructose that we have. We've got to figure out, well, what's the number of moles of fructose since that's the solute. So in order to do that, we're going to have to figure out the molecular weight of fructose. So 12.01, which is carbon, times 6, plus 12 times 1.08, plus 6 times 16. So I get, well... 180.16 uh, grams for every one mole of fructose. Okay. So, 25 divided by that gives us 0 0.139. Are we good? Yep. Yes. Okay. So um, now let's figure out, well, what's the molality of this? So we say 0 0.139 moles divided by 0 0.2500 kilograms. So that's going to equal 0 point, so the three six figs. Five, five, five molal. And what did they ask? The expected freezing point, right? Okay. Right. Okay. So let's figure out what's the temperature that uh, this solution's freezing point is going to change. Okay. So the temperature change is going to equal, well, fructose doesn't break up into ions, okay? So it's just going to be, in this case, um, M times the Kf, or Kf times M, okay? I think they write it Kf times M, right? From the most guy. Okay? So, we get 1.86 degrees C divided by 1M times 0.555M. Cancel, cancel. <coughs> so what's it going to lower it? 1.0. Three degrees C. Okay. So freezing point depression. Remember. Okay. So what's the new freezing point? Is going to be the um, original freezing point minus 
the change in temperature that we just figured out. Okay? So, the original freezing point of water is 0, 0.00 degrees Celsius. And we're going to subtract that, subtract 1.03 from that. So that's going to give us a number of negative 1.03 degrees Celsius for our new freezing point. Okay. Are there any questions on that one? No.